Hello and welcome to the Fast Reports Academy. Today I will show you two ways of navigating through your report. The outline and the bookmarks. Let's look at the bookmarks and the hyperlinks for a start. Here is how they function. We have a list of product categories with the products that are contained in those categories. And at the start of the report, there is a list of the category names. If you click one of those, you will navigate to the category you've chosen. And then, you can return to the first page of the report using this button. Navigating to the specific report page is very easy. You just should set the hyperlink to the page number and insert that number in here. Then there are bookmarks. To create a bookmark, you should select an object and then set some text in its bookmark property. This text will serve as the ID. You can set the bookmark dynamically. For example, this data band sets it to its category name. We create the bookmarks to navigate to them. This can be done with the hyperlinks. This is the list of the category names that is generated from the data table. The category names are the same as those in the groups, and we can use them in the hyperlinks. So, this is how this list works like a table of contents for the categories. Now let's look at how we can add an outline. It's in the properties too. We can set it to the same text for the instances of the same band. But it's not what we need right now. So we need to set it just like the bookmarks. It should be the category name here. And as you can see, we now have an outline for the categories. You can also set the outline for the child band. The value will be the product name. And this will result in the products being in the outline. So, now you know how you can set up two kinds of navigation in your report. This was today's lesson on thefastreport.net. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments. In the description, you can find a link to the list of articles on Fast Report.